vivere. A few words about an Italian motion picture. Um, to live, vivere. In which, probably, perhaps, uh, there is a lot to like. I just didn't find it. <laughs> um, yes, on the one hand, it is a feature about our busy life, uh, stress, the tension, the, 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 the hustle, the, the lack of time which people face, uh, the pressure of doing so many things and then failing because one is, is forgetting something, let's say the phone, in one place and then uh, one is unable to do uh, anything else in the other uh, areas of one's life. But then on the other hand, I mean, Michaela Ramazzotti, probably the daughter of the singer who was sort of famous around here, man, but I can't uh, remember Ramazzotti, well, but Enzo Ramazzotti was it? Anyway, um, I, I think she is well-intentioned. Perhaps she's very good, again, like the movie, and I just don't get it. But to me, it looked like a pathetic, over-the-top, um, um, uh, artificial, um, heavy-handed interpretation, uh, which frankly annoyed me. I mean, uh, so uh, it's difficult to see which is it, the hand on the egg. Is it because the material is not so great and so the actress had to uh, go the extra mile and exaggerate because there wasn't much there to just act professionally and uh, with equanimity and balance and, and, and restraint and the way it should be, I, I'd say. Uh, going back, a few centuries, um, is it De Bro? Um, I've read in one of the classics, French, I'm thinking De Bro. And for the actors it is well known, it's probably, I mean, surely there in, the, in their classes, in the history of acting or whatever. This problem of deciding, hey, you go on stage and try and be the character with passion, with uh, gusto, with acceleration, whatever, exaggeration, or you use a cool head. You don't, uh, and I think the example is, uh, it's also here. I don't have the talent, I don't have the training, so I can get overexcited and think I'm telling you the story of the film, of the classic text, and you get it and you enjoy it. And, but then it's not the case. I'm getting worked up. I don't have the cool head. I don't have the training. And then the result is the, the story told by the fireplace, which is the... <laughs> but it's not in operation. Inshallah in the afternoon, if I can manage to get it. So anyway, hey, hey, you have to use the head and you have to think how to render the emotions to the audience, not get passionate. On. And you hear those statements, oh yes, I love the role and I, I got into it and I, I felt, no, you don't, it seems going back again to the classics, you have to use uh, a different approach. So, is it the material or is it the actress which had material but she just went over the top? So, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, but it 
looks like it's both. The material was not that was good, and the actors may be phenomenal, but she didn't, for this view, didn't really uh, do the right thing in, in this. Uh, she's the mother who's always busy. Mm, she's a, 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 a dancing teacher. She teaches the dancing. Um, married to Luca, they both have, well, at least he has, not just an affair, but a baby with Marianne, what's her name? Uh, foreigner in Italy. Um, eventually helped by Susie, aka Miss, Miss Ramazzotti, uh, who doesn't know that this woman is pregnant with her uh, husband. She keeps saying, well, uh, men are no good. They, they, they get you pregnant, but then they, they, it's no use to talk to them. They don't do anything. She herself is falling for the specialist, the doctor, who's trying to treat, uh, investigate, see what's wrong with her, her daughter, who has asthma. So um, complicated uh, amore uh, over there, l'amore, che, che muova la, la luna e gli altri stelli, something like Dante said, the love that moves the the moon and the other stars in probably in um, in um, uh, it can't be in the inferno or the purgatory it must be in, in heaven in his classic um, masterpiece um, in one of the three parts but It's, it's not one of the great Italian movies, alas, I think. <laughs>